Good evening. It's day 16, Monday, May 16, 2022. Acts chapter 4, verse 31. After they prayed, the place where they were meeting was shaken, and they were all filled with the Holy Spirit and spoke the word of God boldly. Following Pentecost, the Holy Spirit was actively empowering and expanding the body of Christ. As opposition arose, the faithful turned to the Lord, seeking even greater boldness and assurance of His continued presence through a fresh infilling of the Holy Spirit. The Greek word for boldly is parisia, which means boldness, openness, confidence. It, can be, it conveys the uh, idea of freedom to speak openly or plainly, freely, without hindrance. Many in our day are speaking boldly, proclaiming ideologies from A to Z. But notice the disciples spoke the word of God boldly. Could it be that a fresh infilling of the Holy Spirit would bring an enablement to the body of Christ to boldly proclaim the powerful, redeeming, reconciling love of Christ to a world desperate for hope, help, and healing. How would the Lord Jesus like to use each of us in these days of division, increased lawlessness, and tremendous need? We need a new Holy Spirit in feeling, bringing freedom to openly share His word with confident boldness. Lord Jesus, open our eyes and ears to see as you do. Create in our hearts a new hunger for intimacy with you and a fresh and feeling of your spirit. Bringing freedom and boldness in sharing your love and good news. What is the Holy Spirit saying to you today about the Lord's protection, direction, and revelation for your life and the life of of the Lafilness Church. Today's uh, devotion was written by Paul Hartley, District Superintendent from Alaska. Thank you very much, Barangay Lafilness. God bless you. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.